it's called a highlighter not a bronzer i am tired of hearing people call it bronzer bronzer you have bronzer what's bronzer used for it's called a highlighter highlighter bronzer is actually a different terminology it refers to a different thing okay so it's highlighter not bronzer okay hello guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here welcome my name is ivy and i'm a makeup artist based in asaba delta state nigeria and in today's video i'm going to be sharing with you my top five favorite highlighters for dark skin so if this is the content you would like to see then please keep on watching and don't forget to like comment share and subscribe to my channel down below okay let's get right into the video so all these highlighters i have what do i look out for in highlighters number one I love highlighters that have this golden rose gold um, bronzy pinkish rosy pink undertones those are the kind of highlighters I like because those are the kind of highlighters that sit well on my skin tone I have a lot of melanin I'm dark skinned and so I don't like to go for those icy whitish champagne colors they tend to just appear stuck on my face and I don't like the look of that. The second thing I look out for in a highlighter are highlighters that are buildable. Like you can apply and layer it without it looking chunky or giving you that artificial look. No, without it looking unnatural, if that makes any sense. And that brings us to the third Thing I always look out for in highlighters. I tend to stay away from loose highlighters because I, I don't like the way they sit on the skin and they most of them tend to have this chunky glitter kind of thing. Very rarely do you see loose highlighters that are smooth and soft on the skin. So the third thing I look out for in highlighters is I love highlighters that are in a pressed powder form. That is my preference personally and those are the three things I look out for in highlighters. So these highlighters I'm going to be sharing with you today all match these things to a T. Okay? Now, let's start with the very very first, the most expensive of them all is this Huda Beauty 3D HD highlighter the golden sands edition I really love this highlighter palette a lot and it's the kind of highlighter palette that I can use for my skin tone if you can see this one has like a wet feel to it so I really do not use this but this this and this I really love this is like a light gold this is like a rosy pink undertone and this one is like a deeper gold this is actually my favorite among the lot and I've had this um, highlighter palette for a while now and it's still going strong Huda Beauty like they know what they were doing when they made this highlighter palette now I think they have a deeper shade for those who are like more on the higher end of the melanin spectrum but for people who are like my skin tone and slightly darker or slightly lighter this would be your best bet okay the second highlighter we are going to be talking about today comes in this Black Radiance True Complexion Contour Palette in the shade medium to dark. Now this is supposed to be, sorry about that, I just made use of it earlier today. This is supposed to be a contour palette but you can see it does come with the contour is cup and the highlight this highlight has like a bronzy gold undertone to it and this actually is still because you have like three products in one but this highlight is really really good very soft very beautiful like it doesn't leave those chunks on the skin it kind of blends in into the skin and gives that subtle glow from within I really don't like highlighters that are like very visible and blinding some people like that I whatever works for you it's just makeup it comes up at the end of the day but this is just my own personal preference so this is the second highlighter palette I would recommend for you if you have dark skin tone like me okay the third highlighter palette I have right here is from a Nigerian brand Zaron Cosmetics and 
it is iron mm, this is strange actually but bronzer palette <laughs> it's supposed to be a highlighter palette well whatever ticks they are fancy the iron bronzer palette in gold crush I like a palette. I'm not going to call it bronzer palette, please. I don't like that name. <laughs> I don't like when people call this a bronzer. So this is the Zyron Highlighter Palette. And it comes in three shades. If you can see. It has this rosy pink one. It has this light gold one. And then it has this deeper gold um, highlight. And so if you have any skin tone, it, do, it can work for you. Like you can make it work. So it's like a three in one. Thing, depending on the look you have going on and what you just want or feel like using on that particular day actually quite affordable too it's a really beautiful product applies subtly on the skin really really nice very soft very very finely nailed Zaron did a good job with this product and I have been loving it the fourth product here on our list is the Avon True Color Moon Lead Highlighting Powder now most people do not know that Avon has a lot of these products this is in the shade moon lit by the way <laughs> so um, Avon does this thing where from time to time they tend to discontinue their best selling products I don't know what happened but I've not been seeing this on their website I think they are probably coming out with something but we don't know yet but if you can find or lay your hands on an older stock of this please go ahead and get it this has like it's a color changing highlights it's at times it ap applies like a light gold at times it applies like a bronzy color at times it applies like like a light pinky bronzy pink color kind of i really do love it it sits well on my tone really really finely milled um i i'm not really swatching this product because i already have i've already explained to you an idea of what it looks like maybe just so you see how it applies on the skin as you can see just blends well with my skin tone and it blends into the skin like blends into the skin and gives that subtle glow and these are the col kind of colors i like it doesn't sit on the skin like chunks it just blends in very well and i love that a lot the final i um highlighter i have right here is the sleek face contour kit in the shade dark now <laughs> there used to be a time there was a time when sleek makeup was the holy grail of makeup like if you didn't own any sleek makeup or if you didn't own this sleek contour palette <laughs> ha you were not a member of the beauty community <laughs> but for a while i've not really heard people talking about sleek i still order my sleek contour kit because ah, look sleek did well with this product and i love it the contour powder i use a lot and this highlighter shade as well i really do love i also have this in the shade medium i love the medium for contouring my nose because i don't really like those stack nose contour and this has like a golden bronzy gold highlight shade true to the kind of shade through to the kind of shades i love and i go for so this one is a winner if you can lay your hands on this please do go ahead and get you one of these so these are the five products i would recommend if you have deeper skin tone and if you do not like those blinding see me from space kind of highlighters okay so this is the end of our video for today thank you so much for watching i hope you had a nice time and i also hope that while you were watching you also clicked on the subscribe button down below if you haven't please just scroll down on your phone click on that subscribe button and come right back Thank you so much for doing that and I'll see you in our very next video next week. So uh -huh, I didn't add that, turn on your notification bell, just click on that bell so that whenever I upload you get notified and you can watch. Okay, alright guys, I'll see you in my very next video. Bye guys.